Thanks for calling the Is My Shit Tight Hotline. This is where you call and leave your feedback on our songs of the week. This week's song is Don't Do It For You No More by Party Next Door. Say I, say I don't, say I don't do for you no more, baby. Produced by Business Boy, Southwest, and Theory. If you haven't heard this song yet, please go to ismyshittight.com slash hotline, listen to the song, call us back, and tell us what you think about it. Make sure you let us know where you're calling from, what your name is, and where we can find you on your social networks. Cheers. Hey, what's up? Yeah, I just heard that party next door. Uh, it, it was pretty good. Honestly, like right about two minutes in, I feel like the voices in the background could have been a little higher. Like, I feel like I could barely hear that shit. You know, it would have sound real good if that was like half as much louder, you know? But besides that, that was, that was pretty good shit. Like, I'll probably listen to it again. I'm not going to give you my fucking name because y'all y'all don't even know that shit. But uh, I am out in Honolulu. I'm originally from Miami. Hi, this is Shrank from Dallas. And I was told to leave a voicemail about the new Party Next Door song. I fell in love with it the minute I heard it. Before he even started singing it, it sounds crazy. But I was so consumed by the music itself. And, you know, the chorus kicked in and I was just hugged. I knew there was no going back. So I think overall I love the composition of the song um every little detail just like you know the beat the guitar I thought was beautiful the same the background the lyrics I think overall just each layer kind of complemented each other in a very pleasing way and I would say it's definitely a very positive feel-good song and to be honest I think I prefer this song over his very last song he released for the album so I hope that helps. So it was good. It's Nate from Wisconsin. Y'all can find me at Nate Forehead. Uh, I fuck with his track, PND. He kept it uh, traditional. He kept it consistent with that Toronto sound that he's known for. He kept it smooth. But he also incorporated some unique elements. I like the guitar and the instrumental and shit. So, you know, he just continues to progress while also remaining a consistent sound. And I appreciate that. And overall, I got to say, the track is pretty tight. I fuck with it. Um, hi, I'm Crystal Cabrera, and I'm from Providence, Rhode Island. It is, I feel like it's just straight fire. Like, Party Next Door always releases fire. There's never, there's never bad, there's never a bad moment in his music that's always related to him. Thank you. Yo, it was, uh, King Lit Jelly. Um, I was talking about that Don't Do It For You. The song is mad tight, man. I wish you would get more, um, more publicity for it. I don't know if the song's gonna be on the album or not, but I think it's dope. The voice is kind of weird, but it's, the, the instrumental is very hot. Very, very hot. Yo, what's up? It's Stefan from Boston, and I just listened to Don't Do It For You No More by Party Next Door. And, you know, I really like the beat of the song. You know, it had a very nice, chill beat. You know, it was really relaxing, something I could just, like, chill to. And, um, Party Next Door in his verses, he really, like, kind of, like, showed how he felt. He was, like, he was very lyrical and had a very, like, strong message of what he was showing. And I, I really like that. That's something that's really valuable to me in the song. But in the chorus, he really showed off his vocal chops, you know. He, his voice is just amazing. So in these choruses, when he sang, say, I don't do it for you no more, you know, it's just, like, something beautiful. It's, like, that's what you expect from Party Next Door song, and that's what you got from the song. And, you know, it's definitely gotten my rotation. I'm so glad it's much retired in the USA.